Hello everybody and welcome to my channel, I'm PixelJP and today we are playing a game called New Record. Um, you're some kind of de uh, journalist, detective I think, but you make friends with a ghost of some kind. I don't know. Art style looked uh, appealing to me. A little bit different to what we've played before. Um, yeah, I'm going to give it a go. Oh, the music. I like the art style. I don't know why. There's something really nice about it. I look like someone who'd work for Shinra, but... Hey. Hi! I mean, Alt! Alt? My wife? Hi, I'm Minerva, and I'm just a journalist of no importance. May I have your name? I wasn't expecting this to be voice acted. I beg your pardon? I'm Sarah Levy. French Levy. Oh, my bad. I'm looking for a ghost. <laughs> Sorry for any French people watching. Whatever do you mean? You're the ghost, dummy. Ha! Sees your chest, madam. Ghosts don't even exist. I'm sorry I'm not talking much. I'm At least sick. I don't think I am. Why like, don't you show me the door then? I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued from the very beginning. The music reminds me of the first level in the I'll place you first start playing anyway. in, um, cool. uh, Lunacid. Lunacid. Good game. Recommend it. Feel like a dungeon crawlers. Oh, okay. We move. I don't need my mouse by the looks of it. I don't know. Clock. The clock is dead. Clock is that because it's laid down? Uh, maybe. Clock heaven. You gotta mis make sure you don't mistake that for cock it. Okay. Log. There's a log on the stairs. We don't have logs in our house. Okay. Coat hanger. This hanger is looking lonely without coats. Well, yeah, my parents went away. Do you know where Oh, is this gonna get I? dark? No, they should be back soon, though. Uh huh. Uh huh. Soon though. Mm. Uh. All right, just this green door. What's behind door number one? Oh hey, door's open. Is it? It's close well, to me. The, it's just the dining room. And let me in. It's the one place I can go. Wow, it is empty in here, huh? Why am I here? Table. Huge table for just three chairs. You mean four? We a family of four. I assure you, only three are around the table. Are you sure you counted right? Counting chairs is one of my most developed skills. <laughs> Man, this is who you're losing your jobs to, people. Learn to count chairs, get any job you want. Be up in the world, man. Not really. It just passes the time. And impresses ghosts. It's quite charming, the dialogue, though. I have to give it that. It's pretty charming. Newspaper. There's a newspaper on the table. I banged my elbow. My really Never mind the newspaper on it. <laughs> it's outdated as hell, though. I must have missed a few. Really? How many? How old? Uh, you don't need to know this right now. How old is the what? newspaper? Why? I'll tell you when you're older. How rude! I read papers too, you know. Oh yeah? Which ones? Just one about ghosts and stuff. It's called paraphysico. Paraphysico. <laughs> is that an oh, actual no, word? That's hilarious. D don't judge me for that. I don't know. No, you, you misunderstand. I'm the person behind that journal. Re really? Oh, Minerva, of course. Oh gosh, I adore your walk, madam. Prepare your butt then, because you're my next star. Really? Oh. The kid's voice is better than the main character's voice, I think. Um, but I like them both so far. I'm liking the minimalist, uh, the minimalist, the minimalist stuff about this words. Uh, the painting's gone. 
Do you still Or is it a painting of grey? Maybe your parents removed it? Uh, maybe. Just kidding, it's probably stolen. <laughs> Just kidding. It's taken away where you'll never see it again. Uh, is this, look, that's a, uh, I forget the name of those candles. That's, that's a Jewish symbol, isn't it? I'm probably wrong, I don't know. I'm pretty sure it is. You ever do that? Just walk around with your face in a wall, just going along it? And you got like a snotty nose, you just go up to a wall. <laughs> Why is it red? Ever starts, we'll know where it came from. What is in here? Impressive set of knives. Thanks. Shame they scrambled all over the place. Out here, my mom's terrible. We ignoring the. Your mom. Ketchup. I assumed you at least had a chef for this kind of kitchen. We did too. I mean, we do. I'm not really sure what happened. I remember my mom cooking as well. And you don't remember what happened to him? No, I'm sorry. I think he's... I think we he's in the broth, you know. Figure it out. Seems to be in the... I'll take a note to incinerate all this crap after I'm done. It can't be that bad. You're lucky you're dead and can't smell this. Stop saying that I'm dead. <laughs> you're lucky you're dead. Dare I look inside? Is that a body? I think that whatever's in there has overflown back to being alive. You shan't escape, abomination. What do you say to me? Not you. I think this is a depressing story. Okay, we'll go further down the hallway. That looks like a... F can I press that? No. Headbutt it just... <clears throat> back in place. Okay. It's a long hallway. Quite cinematic, actually. Enter. This is more empty than I thought. Your eyes must deceive you. Our chef is quite extravagant in his taste and decoration. I believe you, but there's none of it here. How can this be? Eesh. Anything on his bed? No. A letter. Oh, there's an old letter here. What did it say? It's addressed to his These family. These notes. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the same as if he will never see them again. Didn't manage to send it. <laughs> Oh, what did she say? <sighs> Alive. Just. Locked. Locked. What about you? <clears throat> nope. Almost nothing here. That's impossible. This is a maid's room. She keeps it to herself, but it shouldn't be empty. Keys! Hey, a bunch of keys! Oh, maid had key to most rooms. They should be labeled. Yep, they're numbered one to four. Oh, yeah, those are key for a bedroom, I think. They're all upstairs. Okay. Hold on! Are you gonna snoop around in my room? Yeah, I'm gonna find your porn! I don't have a choice, I'm afraid. <sighs> I swear, as soon as I figured out where I am, I'll. That's precisely what we're trying to figure out. I know! I know. Well, the only way upstairs is in the entrance. Okay, thank you for telling me. Uh, am I picking them up? Or am I just leaving them there? I think I may just be leaving them there. Alright. Bye, keys, I guess. <laughs> hey, look, a set of keys. Oh, okay, we reached the end. What's in here? Does this open up anything? Locked. Locked. Right. The dining room. I'm liking the camera angles they've decided to go with on this. But how do I get past? Get Trying over. To make use of my motor functions. Whew. I'm too old for <laughs> Just this. cut there? Okay. 
Didn't even jump. Okay. <laughs> that, was, that was amusing, actually. All right. Uh, let's start down at this end, all the way over here. Okay. First door from the left. That's my room. Oh, no. All right. Moment of truth. Is my kind host going to be in there? I gotta be. Where else would I be? Looks fairly normal and dead bodiless. I can't see what a, Why would you describe it that way? Would Have you ever walked into a room and just gone, ah, oh, I love how bodiless this room is? <laughs> like, okay. Uh, bathroom doer. T tub? I'm not. Oh, it's because I'm probably able to clip through the wall. Bed? Let's go through here. Tub? Tub? Nobody in it. But your own bathroom. Any floaters left in there? I collect them, you see. It's like a hobby of mine. Bed? I don't. Well made. I don't. That was the character talking. Yes. Desk with a mirror. The mirror. I dare say this was immeasurably disappointing. Remembering anything, Sarah? About Am I going to the room? other rooms? Well, nothing special. I guess my dad visited my room more often than to talk about our chef and our maid. He tried to explain why they were gone. So your servants were gone after all? That's why your mother was cooking and cleaning in their stead, I assume. And why their room was empty. Did we cannibalize them? I don't know, that's what I'm going towards. Cannibali uh, cannibalization. Second I don't know if that's a left. word or not. That's my brother's. Been a while since I last saw him. Is he a teenager? Because I know what he's doing. No? Ha! <laughs> I'm not going through that mess. Oh, because it's a, uh, it's a teenage boy's room. <laughs> Get it? Uh, enter. Door from the right. That's my parents' room. My Where parents' room. Well, let's hope this one ain't wrecked. There's a lot hmm. of papers under the bed. A bit dusty, but otherwise unremarkable. Uh, bed. Ooh, there's something under the bed. <gasps> the floor! A photos and a letter. Under the bed? All photos of the same young man. Some of them seem to be torn as if they're parts of larger photos. Only one young man in my house. He must be my brother. The letter is addressed to your parents. He specifically asks to be forgotten and for any evidence of him being here to be destroyed. <clears throat> what? Okay, I have no idea where this story is going. Told, but couldn't bring themselves to destroy everything. But why would he say that to them? Sarah, does the term la résistance mean anything to you? Is this going to get political? My... Why? Uh... No reason. Okay. Anything else around here? Desk? Nothing on the desk. Drawers are completely empty. Okay. Uh, is there anything here other than the bathroom? Oh, there's dresser. Barely anything left in there. Alright, bathroom. Nothing here. Set out exactly the same, pretty much. All right, leave. First door from the right. All right, here That's we go. That's my father's office. Office. I'm not usually involved in there. Damn. Oh. Now there's info all over the place. I'll need a shovel for this. I'll have to pick it up. Okay. Uh, desk is probably the main thing it wants me to interact with, but I'm gonna look at the bookcase. Sniff the books. <laughs> desk. Interesting. What is? Your father was quite the influential man, wasn't he? What do you mean, was? 
He did his best to protect the people he cared about, especially you. Well, he tried anyway. What is this camera angle? Servants depart show. Nice shoulder blade. Uh, I. Can... Uh. The point is that anti-Semitism was hard to fight against back then. His last plans mention a cellar. I don't suppose you know anything about that. No. That's all right. I found keys to the library room here. It's probably the last. Library place. room. That's the room in the hallway we couldn't get into, right? Okay. Why is this charming? Like, why is this charming? Uh, go over. Uh, this way. <clears throat> there we go. We're now in the Daibi room. Not many people are going to get the references I'm doing there with that. They're just going to think I sound hey, really Sarah, dumb. did you know the earth was round? Are you mocking me? <laughs> I know, right? Couldn't believe it either. Uh... Blocked door. Uh, there's another door over there, but just checking all the way around. I know the music's technically unremarkable, but it fits the atmosphere perfectly. Of course, you'd have a wine cellar. <laughs> I think I just heard your voice more clearly. Then you must be in there. Probably. Alive. Well, the door is locked. <sighs> if you're still alive, I don't suppose you could open it for me. <clears throat> Actually, uh, no. Huh? Huh? I won't open it. Why? I'm not supposed to open it to anyone. Right. And not because you can't open it. How long are you going to lie to me and yourself? Don't call me a liar. You could easily be one of those officers looking to finish me off. And you're the What one is the story here? I remember that the paraphysical was founded in the 18th century. And you're its sole writer? I'm supposed to believe that you're that old? First of all, were there any women among those officers? Well, no. And besides, maybe I am that old. You read my ghost stories all the time, but can't accept that. Bitch! Hey, when I can't open the door for you. Then I need another way in. <laughs> <clears throat> maybe my dad had another key. I'll just pick the lock if you don't mind. You could do that all along? And we had to go find the keys? Well, <clears throat> are you in? I can't see you. But I can okay. see you. Oh no. Huh? Oh. I'm sorry to announce that the cellar houses only barrels of wine <sighs> and a skeleton. I... Ooh. What? To be fair, I would be much more surprised if you were alive after all this time. What do you mean after all this time? Before that, how's your memory now? I think I remember mostly everything. Okay. Then please, tell me everything. Okay. Well, I remember people's uniforms visiting us a few times. My dad was never happy having them here. Me neither. They took our chef and our maid. Dad <coughs> said they would never get to me. They did try though. I was told to hide here and only come out on the noisy stop. They never stopped though. They kept walking, talking, dragging things. And my parents never came back for me. 
They must have had a plan to get you out but didn't get a chance. You probably died of hunger or cold. But I still won't get it. How can I be dead? I'm still here. Because you haven't accepted you're dead. That's precisely the problem. The fact that you stayed behind as a ghost. I'm supposed to believe that they exist now? Yes. I still don't get it. Why did I become a ghost then? Because I died without having fulfilled some wish? To help any trespasser? Oh, nothing romantic like that. The actual reason is... complicated. So in this Tell world, people know ghosts me. exist? I... Okay. So, when a person dies, their soul traverses the veil that separates the realm of the living and the dead. And I, what, took a wrong turn? No, rather you were pushed back. Probably. How does that happen? Uh, plenty of possible reasons, but my guess is that it's because of your parents. They must have died before you did, while being aware of your situation, and wished you to live as long as possible. So they went through. Fucking parents. And you man. did not. Are you really just a ghost? I am. I just happened to come across anomalies like these and solve them before they become public. Hold up. How can you keep them secret if you write about them in your journal? By publishing them after the anomaly is gone, there's no more tangible proof of it. But the first articles are from a century ago. Yeah. That's all you have to say about that? Yep. Are you a ghost? Are we a ghost? A we spirit don't have much time left. Before what? The next morning. People are coming to inspect this house. I would spare them an encounter with a ghost. So, that means getting me to the other side, right? I see my parents there. When people die in the same time frame, yeah, they can sometimes find each other on the other side. But souls don't last beyond the veil forever. After a few months, they just dissipate. Well, surely it hasn't been that long since my death. Go on, how long has it been? I'm sorry to say that we're currently past the 21st century. That cannot be. By being stuck among the living, your soul lasted a long time here. But even your time will expire soon. You won't get to see the beyond. It probably won't comfort you that much, but know that the war is over and the people who took your family. Have Sorry, lost. I'm not really talking much, but no, I'm just really engrossed in the it story. Doesn't comfort me at all. We still have some time. I'll be with you until the end. Okay. Okay. I don't want it's the, the idea of nothingness of to disappear. Would you like to recall it for me? You can tell me whatever you want, good or bad. Sure, okay. Where to begin? Can't be that much, you're like what? Thank you. Ten. <laughs> the time has come. Are you ready? Yes. No. How could I ever be ready for this? So just do it. Okay. Listen closely. Mm -hmm. Relax and imagine that you're in a dream. Before you is a curtain. And you're one step away from going through. A force is pushing you forward. And all you have to do is let it. Yes, I see it. A lullaby for the adrift. Okay, cool achievement. Jump scare. No. Okay. Is there anything hidden around here? No? Can I interact with a skeleton? Is the skeleton going to follow me? Is she not really gone yet? Oh, there's stuff this side. Anything down here? I would have thought the game would have ended then, but fair enough. That's what I'd have thought. Why are we at this camera angle now? It's 
camera angle's changed completely. Don't get in that room. Okay. Why is the camera angle completely changed? But then there was that broken, fallen down clock. Can I not move that? Like, at all? Um, okay. Oh! Well, there we go. Uh... Yeah! This is really, really cool. I like it. Nice short story. Um, sorry if I weren't talking in certain places, but I should have been. Just, you know, I was just kind of getting enthralled in the story. But, um... Yeah. I really, really enjoyed that. I'll put the link to the game for its Steam page in the description down below. Um, I'll also put it in the treasure vault in the Discord. Don't forget, if you want to join the Discord, that'll be in the description down below as well. But yeah, I really, really like this. I thought it was really, really cool. Um, mysterious, sweet, little time killer. So yeah, recommend. Uh, and all I have left to say is be good to yourselves, be good to each other. I'm going to love you and leave you, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.